people have always looked for deeper meaning in their lives, but right now, the world feels very scary. We almost buy into the, to the idea that the busier we are, the more important we are. Part of this is, who do we listen to? If they're listening to society, if they're listening to Madison Avenue, they're always going to fail. But if they're listening to the gospel, the message is, you are beloved of God. You are a precious creature. I think I can hear him all day, but it's a question of whether I stop to listen. Where God wants to take us may be um, somewhere we just don't want to go. You can't hear much of anything <laughs> in the middle of this, God's voice or anything else. There's just so much going on, man. It's just consuming. When you get home, you just time to crash and start all over again. I think it can be lost. If you, if you crowd it out entirely, then I'm afraid that you lose that connection in the busy parts of your life. Our life is very conducive to listening to God because we do not have a lot of distractions. And in this life, we really slow down. To be cloistered is to live a life that is purposely an environment that is carved out so that you have silence and solitude and can more easily listen to God.